City Council just won't stop clucking. And this time they're debating chickens, again. And it's not about which came first, but whether chicken coops should be allowed in the city. Alan Hale brings us that story. Louise Hanavan used to have three chickens living next to this shed in her backyard. But all she has now are photos. The chickens had to go after her neighbors complained that they were attracting rats. Stone wall here. Um, so I saw them like running through the bushes when I moved here. And the chickens, of course, were close to that area. So those rats that lived there um, were interested in the chicken feed. After two years, chickens are still banned from urban neighborhoods. But now the city councillors from the peninsula are opening up the issue again. They're starting a new study to look into whether chickens can be safely raised on the peninsula and if the bylaws should be changed to let people do so. People were clearly divided on the issue. Let's be perfectly clear chickens are not pets, even if you treat them as such. I don't think that having an animal in your household um, that once something becomes useful, then it should be on a farm. The study is going ahead despite a staff report that came out a year ago, which recommended that the issue should be dropped. Councillor Jennifer Watts is pushing the chicken issue forward. So I think in this way, it's not sort of a general discussion, you know, do we want to consider it or is it a good idea? But this one would be looking at if we did go forward, what would be the specifics of a bylaw based on what other municipalities are doing, based on what feedback we're hearing. The study will finish in the next couple of months. It'll be at that point that they will recommend either to let chickens on the peninsula or to scrap the issue entirely. For the facts, I'm Alan Hale.